years ago, but since then they have never enjoyed the fruits of their independence. Yes. And this is clearly to demonstrate how the Western world has never wanted a stable African state to, to, to prosper. Uh, 200 years ago, Haiti was among the richest country because it used to provide, produce sugar. Sugar was How a, many years ago? 200 years ago. It okay. was, sugar was the highest selling commodity in the world. If you were producing sugar, you were the richest country. The way we have black, uh, crude oil today in Saudi mm. Arabia, that was how sugar was important then. Today, Haiti is the poorest country. It cannot, does not have anything. Is because the Western world has worked so much to destroy that country. Do me a favor, because you have the Star newspaper there. Please yes. just just carry for me the front page. Yes. Uh, to, to the camera. Yes. Uh, that is what you have on the front page of the Star. Uh, if you have there today, I've given you an assignment. <laughs> 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 that is on the front page, and yes. that is a gang. That is a really what's happening on the front page. Yes. Uh, Haiti. That is a gang marauding gangs. The violent protest in Haiti. And uh, the Prime Minister was here a fortnight ago again yes. to see the deal with President yes. William Bruto. And he's not been able to go back to his country. He tried to fly back yesterday. Yes. He was forced to go back to Puerto Rico. He cannot be able to land into Haiti at the moment because the gangs have taken over the streets. The airport, yes, it is closed. The ports are closed, but they cannot access their country. I know of many Kenyans who are supposed to go to prepare for the arrival of the Kenyan police forces mm. there. They, they are stuck in America. So we have a problem in this country that is beyond the imagination of anybody. We already have Gaza as a problem, but this is the worst that is the humanity can face Christmas, at the from the U.S., to Haiti, yes. it's like a stone throw. It's like from here to where you are. Yes. Compared to from where we are here in Kenya to Haiti. Yes. Hours of traveling and layovers and et cetera, et cetera. I mean, why Kenya of all the nations and why Kenya police of all the nations, of all the forces under the sun? I mean... It's quite unfortunate that you know? uh, for the first time the, the Western world has been able to fail as the policeman of the world. Mm -hmm. And now they are relying upon a small country like Kenya to try and police something that they created themselves. Uh, around 1920s, the U.S. tried to colonize the Haiti. And from that time, Haiti has never been anything as a good country. Mm. It has been ruled by dictators. They have destroyed that country. America has tried to impose How presidents. How many presidents have they assassinated? They have assassinated so many. They have tried to impose their own leadership. Yes. And nothing has come out of it. And unfortunately, natural disasters have also followed the Haiti. We had the earthquake. We had the tsunami the other day. All these are challenges that the country has faced. But since then, nobody has been able to try and deal with these issues decisively to be able to address the challenges of it. Is it because they are black? And maybe that's why the African countries like Kenya led felt that we need to solve, we need to clean this black stain of every black country in the world having challenges. Probably we have an opportunity as a country to demonstrate our cap capacity. But do we have the money? Do we have the resources? Yeah. Do we have the understanding of the infrastructure in Haiti? These people are French speaking. How many of our police will speak French? Do we